Hey guys, John Lizard here for Jam Sports 100 and Jam Sports Show. How's it going? I'm here to make Jam Sports Picks for March 7th, 2013. Video is a little bit late, so let's not waste any time. Let's get ready to it. We went 3 and 1 in the NHL on Wednesday. With that, we are 47 and 35 on the year and a lifetime. Alrighty, let's take a look at the games now. For Thursday, actually, took the scores from Wednesday first. Toronto gets by Ottawa. 5 to 4 as Chicago continues their point streak because they get a 3 2 win over Colorado. Calgary gets past San Jose 4 to 1, and Anaheim shuts out Phoenix 2 0. Alright, Tampa, I'm sorry, uh, first game for Thursday Toronto and Boston. Give me Toronto. Buffalo and New Jersey, give me New Jersey. The New York Rangers and the New York Islanders. I am going to go with the Islanders. Um, Penguins and Flyers. I'm going with the Penguins, Florida, and Washington. Give me Florida. Montreal, Carolina. Going with Montreal. Vancouver and Columbus. Give me Vancouver. Winnipeg and Tampa Bay. Give me Tampa Bay. Edmonton and Detroit. Give me Edmonton. St. Louis and Phoenix. Give me a good game there. Give me Phoenix. And, uh, Dallas and Los Angeles. Give me LA. And, by the way, you can see Pittsburgh and Philadelphia at 7 o'clock Eastern Time on NHL Network. All right, let's move now to college basketball. Had a bit of a rough day over there uh, yesterday. If you were in the top 25, you, you had a rough day, pretty much. Uh, top 25 got roughed up yesterday. We went 14-9 and nine in college basketball yesterday, making our record on the year 624 and 217, 1,610 wins, and 667 losses is the lifetime uh, record there. So... There you go. Uh, Villanova took down 5th ranked Georgetown, 67-57. Georgia Tech took down 6th ranked Miami, 71-69. Purdue almost took down Michigan. Michigan came back in that game late and gets the win, 80-75. Number 11, Florida takes down Vandy, 66-40. 12th ranked New Mexico gets by Nevada, 75-62. Iowa State upsets Oklahoma State, uh, 87-76. Xavier upsets 16th ranked St. Louis, 77-66. Remember that was a game I said to watch out for. 17th ranked Syracuse gets by DePaul pretty easily, 78-57. VCU, Virginia Commonwealth beats Richmond, 93-81. 82, rather, and Washington State upsets number 23, UCLA, 73-61. All right, let's take a look now at the games for Thursday. First of all, a couple of top 25 games to look at. Number 22, Wisconsin takes on Michigan State. You know I'd love to call for the upset here, but I can't do it. I'm going to go with Michigan State. <coughs> Excuse me. Number 19, Oregon takes on Colorado. A little nervous here to not call for an upset. But I'm not going to. I'm going to go with Oregon. Virginia and Florida State. Give me Virginia. Kentucky and Georgia. Give me Kentucky. Drake and Bradley. Give me Bradley. Penn State and Northwestern. Give me Northwestern. Butler and Massachusetts. Give me uh, Butler. USC Upstate takes on Jacksonville. Give me USC Upstate. Louisiana Tech takes on New Mexico State. Give me Louisiana Tech. Oregon State and Utah. Give me Oregon State. A little bit nervous. Oregon State has lost four of their last uh, five. I believe, and so they're not playing that great, but I think they are going to get back on their winning ways uh, tonight. Sam Houston State and Stephen F. Austin. I'm going to go with Stephen F. Austin. Texas State and Utah State. Give me Utah State. Uh, Southern Illinois takes on Missouri State. Give me Southern Illinois. And last but not least, we have Long Beach State taking on UC Davis, and I'm going to go with Long Beach State. All right, two games to go in the uh, NBA on Thursday, but before we do that, we do want to say that we did go 11-3 and three on Wednesday. Let's go over some scores uh, really quick. The Nets get past the Bobcats pretty easily, 99-78. The Cavs get 20 points from Kyrie Irving, and it gives them a 104-101 win over the Jazz. The Celtics get 18 points from KG. And that was good enough. Boston gets an 83-81 win over the Pacers. Atlanta gets by Philadelphia, 107-96. LeBron James comes out and has 26 points for the Heat as they squeak by the Magic, 97-96. Uh, as far as the Knicks and Pistons go, as far as the Knicks go, no mellow, no problem. 
They got 26 points instead from Raymond Felton, and that was enough for them as the Knicks get the 87-77 win. The Grizzlies get by the Trailblazers, 91-87. The Lakers come back from being down 42 points, and Kobe Bryant helps them out as they get a 108-102 win over New Orleans. The uh, Timberwolves get by the Wizards, 87-82. Dirk Nowitzki had 22 points as the Mavs beat the Rockets 112-108. Uh, Spurs 101-83 win behind 18 points from both uh, Tim Duncan and Manu Ginobili. And Toronto gets by the Suns 98-71. Clippers get by the Bucks 117-101. And Golden State gets by the Sacramento Kings. 87-83. All right, two games on the schedule for Thursday. Both of them on TNT. I'm sorry I'm rushing this so bad, but I kind of want to get this up before everything starts, which is only in about 25 minutes. I'm running a little bit late today. Uh, Kevin Durant in the Thunder take on the Knicks. TNT, 8 o'clock Eastern Time. I'm going to go with the Thunder. And in the second game of the doubleheader, Blake Griffin and the Clips taking on... Ty Lawson in the Nuggets, 10.30 Eastern Time. And I'm going to go with the Clippers. All right, that is going to do it for me. NASCAR fans, coming up as soon as this gets uploaded, I'm going to put up the entry list for both the Cup Series and the Nationwide Series this weekend in Las Vegas. All right, that is going to do it for me, guys. So I am John Lombard up for JM Sports 100 and the JM Sports Show. This has been JM Sports Picks for March 7th, 2013. I will see you guys tomorrow.